Stanford University. The governance project is going to try to conceptualize and measure governance uh, defined as something separate from democracy. Uh, Americans especially tend to think that democracy is an intrinsic part of good governance. How can you have good governance if you don't have elections and accountability uh, and so forth? But in fact, uh, authoritarian regimes are better or worse governed and we need a way of focusing on that and capturing that and then asking the question, does democracy actually make things better or worse? This has become a very important issue because the argument is out there that if you're a highly corrupt country with weak, ineffective institutions, any money that goes in is just going to be wasted. It'll end up in a Swiss bank account of some uh, president. Uh, and therefore, uh, and, and furthermore, there's clear evidence that good governance is critical to economic development. If you don't have good property rights, uh, if you don't have a rule of law, if you don't have basic political stability, you're not going to grow. And therefore, uh, a lot of aid agencies have actually made measured governance a condition. Our hope is that we will, first of all, look at the question of the generic question of governance. Uh, what are the existing measures? What kind of data is out there? And how can we do better? Because I think that really we, we need much more fine-grained uh, um, uh, measures of governance. And then the theoretical question about what the relationship of governance and democracy is. Uh, and then we want to do a series of talks, uh, of workshops on both China and the United States and the way that governance actually uh, works in these two very big, very complex societies. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.